Welcome back, everybody, to the Long Ranger. Okay, I fucked up. Welcome back to Book, everyone. In a shark's stomach. Where's my chest? Please don't tell me that I've lost it. There were so many useful things in it. Wait a second. I didn't lose it. It was a shark who attacked my boat. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. It ate my chest. It's an odd sentence. Please kill some sharks until you find the one who ate my chest. So I, I had to fucking do a genocide just, just to find a chest that you lost. Okay, sir. Wait, I was about to actually go do that because who the hell do you think I am? But yeah, welcome back to Book. I think this is the Wall of Flesh episode. Yeah, it is. All right, sweet. So uh, I've been given some tips here. And uh, it was... Don't use meteorite bullets. All right. You know, maybe it's just the past or nostalgia. But I always thought the meteorite bullets are really good. But who knows? I don't, apparently. But, uh, you know, back in the day, I felt like they were good. But they aren't now. I was told by the uh, developer of the Enigma mod... That they're gonna work on this area as in it's not gonna have high spawn rates like it does but yeah we gotta fight alpha cactus worm imp lord wall of flesh no problem man that's easy the one we'll probably have the worst time with is the wall of flesh and that's not even that hard of a boss either it's just like it's gonna take a while to set up the arena for the wall of flesh like always it always does yeah, we're going to head over to the uh, desert, which is not this direction. Don't know why I'm going that direction. We're going to go over here towards the actual desert, not that direction. And we're going to see what beauty, what a beautiful thing we can find down there. Hopefully a elongated worm or an elongated worm. But yeah, I have secured the bag today. I went out, you know, it's payday. I did a little buying, even though I'm trying to save up money, obviously, for the move. And uh, I secured a Pokemon. Let's go Eevee. Let me see if I can make you guys sonically hear the noise. You hear that? It's the plastic wrap on it. But I picked up Eevee, even though I wanted to pick up Pikachu. Uh, and then I thought about it. I'm like, Pikachu's kind of easy to catch. But there's a couple of version exclusives you can get. And I picked up a Pro Controller. It's a wired one, not a wireless one. I don't feel like spending uh, 80 more dollars, 60 more dollars. Because I bought a, Ga a GameStop one that was on sale only it was under twenty dollars and uh we're gonna see how good it is hopefully it's not that bad i mean it's only 20 bucks i wouldn't regret it that much if it stopped working in a couple of days but yeah secured the bag hopefully i get better at smash we're gonna see me slowly evolve i i don't think i posted a smash video yet whenever this goes up but i'm gonna try my best i haven't posted the smash stream i did because i was trying to think of a thumbnail <laughs> And I have no idea what to do for thumbnails. You know, before a series comes out, there's always one thing that's got to come into mind. And if it doesn't come into mind, it's usually ugly. And I'm honestly talking about thumbnails here. So if I don't have a thumbnail in mind, if I don't have it visually pictured in my mind, then it's going to more than likely come out ugly. And I don't like it. I've done it a couple times and I've regretted it. Because I know I could do better. You could do better. Come on, game writers. You can make a way better thumbnail than that. But yeah, let's go ahead. I'm going to set up a little arena real quick here. I don't know how long it will take. It'll probably take like a minute. Uh, but yeah, I'll be right back. You know, I had an ammo box at some point in time. I don't know where it's at. <laughs> what the fuck? Where did I put that ammo box at? All right. Whatever. Let's do it. It is time to fight the alpha cactus worm, which hopefully shouldn't be too bad of a fight. I'm going to use the overloaded blaster. Oh, when did we use this? I feel like piercing shots would be insane on worm type enemies. Come up here. I know you want to come up here. Ooh. Uh, oh, that's not bad. You got to just get the right angle. Oh, my God. Look at his health. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's getting shredded right now. Oh, my. I've never seen so many tens in my life. Oh, it stopped. You got to come up a little higher, my guy. Oh, here we go. God damn. Like, honestly, I've barely got to hit him. I don't even gotta hit him now. Oof. I wanna see that against the bigger version now. Let's see how that's like. See if it even affects him the same way. Does this go through the wall or not? I feel like I was hitting enemies through the wall sometimes. I mean, it doesn't go through thick walls. It doesn't go through like small walls like this. Alright, come on. Wait, I have to pick that up, don't I? 
I don't want to pick up the hearts. There you go. All right. Well, let's do it. Ooh, that's a good headshot. That's a good headshot. And now we watch his health go down. Kind of want to hit all his body parts here before he let his health. All right, now we watch his health go down. Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look how fast he's going down. That's some insane dots right there. Alright, get some more hits in there. Get some more hits in there. What you gonna do about it? What you about to do about this, man? What you about to do? You getting dotted to hell. If you guys don't know what dot is, dot means damage over time. And if you guys don't know what AOE is, AOE is area of effect. I'm just letting you know. Some people don't know that. Some people hear me say dot in AOE and they're like, what the fuck are you talking about? Is he speaking the same language? I indeed am, kind of, but uh, there you go. It's usually used in uh, what were those games called? Called like Smite and League, MOBAs, is where I started using that terminology a lot. AOE, no, I keep these statues on it. AOE and dot, head of the Grand Cactus Worm. I kind of want a head statue, but uh, we don't get that luxury. What do we have? We're gonna, yeah, we'll we'll use the cactus hook i've been trying to use it more uh just because the fact i love juice and i love his mod that's it plain and simple we got these boots here i'm not gonna use these i don't want to use them uh because i like what my stuff is already i like what boots and stuff i have already oh he sells something new adventure sign pressing special ability key will tell you to the nurse oh that's low-key good that's why I said low key. It's not high key good. It's low key good. This is better items, obviously, but that's not bad at all. All right, let's grab this next quest. Oh my God, what is going on? <laughs> my vision. Okay, Imp Lord. Let's go. It's go time. I don't know how long it's gonna take to find the Imp Lord. We're gonna figure it out. But yeah, episode twenty is almost here. Now I wanted to keep it as a surprise. What's gonna happen in episode twenty? But let's just say, you no know, book. He's come a long way, and uh, he might get some, he might get some rewards or something, man, for being, you know, the third to last orc. And I feel like there's not enough respect on his name, so he, he might get some awards. We're gonna have an award show for Book. All right, let me just come out and say it. <laughs> but uh, you guys will see. I'll stop. I'll stop hyping it up. I was just meant to hype it up once, but I'm over. I'm talking about it too much now. Shh. Zip your lips. Bzz. Throw away the key. When's if you did that? I don't know. Well, you're fucked. You threw away the key. What are you supposed to do now? R.I.P. I heard a uh, Terraria 1.3.6 is supposed to be huge, which I'm gonna take with a grain of salt until I see it come out. <laughs> but yeah, we're down here trying to find the Imp Lord, and I think we'll do the uh, adventures quest, and then I gotta do a long building I'm not even gonna do a montage i don't know how do you guys feel about montages in uncle carius i feel like it fit him more especially early game given that fishing was a big part of the early game and you know montages work there but i feel like you just slip montages anywhere we'll, we'll call uncle Mo uncle uh carius we'll call him the montage orc He's going to be the one that had all the montages. I'm trying to stay away from them. Because I don't know. How interesting are montages? I usually do montages to show people that I do the work. And just don't use cheat sheet all the time. Because uh, there's probably people out there that still think I use cheat sheet on a fucking daily basis. And I do use it on a daily basis. I use it as a recipe thing. I use it as a little teleport thing. But uh, people think that I, there's probably still people out there like, damn, he probably cheats when he goes off camera. I do not. That is why I stream. And that's why I have montages. So, ha! There you go to all my people who think I'm cheating. I, we made, like, cheating a meme on my channel now. I like it. But I still don't cheat. Just because it's a meme, it doesn't mean I cheat. And I'll tell you when I cheat. So, at least I'm being honest. This gun looks like it should be doing a lot more. But it's not. All the particles are on my screen. I've hit it for, like, 11, 14, 15 every, like, five seconds we need something better use this how come we're not using this baby we just got our hands on this thing and this thing should be amazing for us because it shoots an insane barrage of bullets it does okay damage i think this enemy might have a weird 
defensive thing because we kept on hitting for the same numbers over and over again. It's like 15, 16, 14. We kept on hitting that over and over. All right. Even with a different weapon, we're hitting that. But boom, that should be the last enemy besides the wall flesh. Weak tail whip. Alright, so let's sell this. How much gold are you going to give me for this? One gold? That's not bad. I will take it. But yeah, it is now time to do the most dreaded thing. And that is to prepare for the wall flesh. I got to make a bunch of minecart stuff. And you know all of that. I don't even know if I have a lot of iron. Let's see how much iron I have. I hit my mic right there. I'm sorry for moving. Do I even have iron on this world? Do I have lead on this world? I have no idea. I'm just going to assume iron. Well, do I have lead? <laughs> I don't know. But uh, let's go ahead. Let's start with this, okay? The minecart. I don't think I have enough iron for a minecart. Oof! I think it is time. I hope. I don't know. We're going to see. We're not going to lose much if we lose. Just some potion buffs. Whatever. It's fine. It's okay if we lose. You know, you got to take an L every once in a while. Whoever, who says that? Whoever said you gotta take an L in so long? Whoever says that statement? What the fuck? Okay, well. <laughs> Alright, you know, I was wrong. You gotta take an L every once in a while. And congrats to whoever said that before me. But let's try this again. Buff up. There we go. We did it right this time. Great. Alright, so what's gonna be the goal here? Probably just spam the Geodizer. Because this weapon pierces the most. Dude, we got him at a quarter health. We're not even at my minecart track yet. I feel like I overprepare a lot with minecart tracks. Wait, do I hit his eye or do I hit his mouth? Which one's the weaker one? I think it's his eye. I don't know, whatever. Whoever, who shoots the top eye of the wall flesh? No, I'm changing the game right here. I'm doing something insane. I don't think I ever shoot at the top eye of the wall flesh. I feel like it's the least satisfying eye to shoot at. I don't know what satisfying. Especially if you're fighting it on the left side because your hot bar covers the whole entire thing. And it's just easier shooting straight and down than I feel like shooting up is. But I don't know, maybe it's just preference. Maybe there's somebody out there like, Game Raiders, how the fuck do you shoot at his lower eye? You're insane. I know, I'm sorry. But yeah, boom, bada, bing. Uh, completed. Oh, there's our ammo crate. See, I was wondering where that was this whole time. I was wondering, man. Cough it up. Thank you. Alright, so we got that back. Uh, I don't know what was down here. Just move everything down. But yeah, uh, there's that. We're going to use the trophy. We're going to turn in the ball of flesh. Is it slime rain right now? Oh my god. Can I be annoyed anymore? Uh, hello, juiced. Here is this. And we get the beautiful shield of flesh. I can't wait. I love the shield of flesh. One of my favorite accessories from the juice mod. Love a lot about the juice mod. You'll hear that in the review coming soon. Uh, expect, if not like the 20th, I said it was going to be the 20th during a stream. If not the 20th, expect Christmas Day. At least one of those. Oh my god, I got four different <laughs> emblems. Let's start with that. Open the ammo box. Sandy Dart. Okay. It's like Sandy Cheeks' brother, Sandy Dart. Got the laser rifle. I mean, we'll use that for something. Got the Ranger emblem. David's Ranger emblem. Probably use that. But yeah, shield of flesh. Let's do something here. So we got the charm of luck. We're going to take the charm of luck, all right? These things are really awesome. I really like Alchemist NPC because of these additions right here. But yeah, we're going to take that charm of luck. And uh, we're going to put it. Let me actually store this gold real quick. We're going to put it in here. Okay. And then we're going to look up. A certain different charm here you need a uh, tinkers workbench to do this but we're gonna look up the uh, are they even called charms I don't even know if they're called charms what the fuck are they not called charms wait what the heck okay so we I'm thinking about something completely different then don't worry about that anymore <laughs> that's still pretty useful though not as useful as it could be okay don't worry about what I was talking about uh, in my head I had tokens in my head not whatever that was don't need to throw an emblem. We'll just keep one emblem. It's fine. But yeah, we got this. The ranger emblem. We'll put this here for now. We probably should get warding on it first. Actually. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this. Let's get warding on these. If not warding, at least book. At least armored. One of them. Please. <laughs> I, I need something. 
I think something I could work with. There we go. So we're gonna get rid of the scarf. Scarf is pretty damn useful. I could use the whole playthrough, but just for variety's sake, I'm gonna get rid of it for now. Oh fuck, I should have kept that. How much does this cost? This four gold per? We got a lot of gold. We're good. Come on. Come on. Give me something I like. I will take an armored. I will take a book. Even though I, I just passed the book. But I will take both of them. I passed that book on accident. Though. Give me another book. Come on. I'll make up for it. The warding is pretty good. You know, I'll, I'll take that one, actually. That one is perfectly fine. Okay. I have all my accessories turned off because of uh, the green screen stuff I do at the beginning. Actually, let's do this. I'll turn off the shield because look how big the shield is. It takes up half the screen. Or not half the screen. It takes up half the character. All right. Anything else? No? That looks like that's it. Let me just get rid of these uh, lore things. I'm not going to do this quest. I'm kind of lazy to do this quest. And fuck them. That's why. Uh, we also got these null shards. No idea. Oh, that's what they do. Mystic. I have to do a mystic class at some point. I want to try that out. But yeah, this damage laser rifle. Can we make a ranged weapon? If not, can we make a clockwork assault rifle with it? I'm going to assume we can make a clockwork assault rifle, but uh, I think we need... We can't. We can't make a... What? Why can't we make one? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, man, what the fuck? Does IMK Sushi... Oh, man. Kind of upsetting, isn't it? Uh, I might have to switch the IMK Sushi thing back to the token. Dude, I really wanted the Clockwork Assault Rifle. What the fuck? I thought that would just be a recipe. I thought a single mod would add in the recipe. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. Just sell the laser rifle. We need it then. But I thought even if... I thought not having the token version of IMK Sushi would still allow you to, you know, do a bunch of stuff that the token version allows. I thought it would just be equal on both sides, but I guess not. I guess there is a benefit to having the token version over the regular version. All right, so there's a certain accessory that I want to make here called the Necro Enchantment. 25% chance to not consume ammo and 5% increase in range damage. It's pretty good. I think it's about time we got rid of either this accessory or this accessory. Uh, where you at, man? Come and get some of this overloaded blaster. No, you killed Gaboto, the witch doctor. No. <laughs> Whatever will I do without Gaboto? R.I.P. Gaboto. Okay, I'll take the gel. The gel is always good. You know I have an infinite amount. The infinite amount is just ammo. That's it. It doesn't do anything else. But yeah. Let's go ahead and let's... Uh, let's sell. You never know what you'll get. Uh, that was ass. Let's go ahead and sell all this, and then let's make this uh, enchantment. Because I have a feeling this enchantment is going to be some heat. It's going to be some heat. Even though, you know, it doesn't give you that many buffs. It might be better than the Rune of Wrath or the Sandstorm Boots. So let's see here. Did I put everything in here? Oh, I need the Phoenix Blaster. Oof, I don't know if we're going to have enough of this. Oh, wait, no, we will have enough. You know why? No, oh, wait, that's after mecha bosses. Is it? I don't know. Let me talk to the blacksmith. I, don't, I think it's after mecha bosses is when he sells Hellstone. Fuck. The Hellstone bag has been secured. Sorry if I keep hitting my mic. I have it in a position to where I can uh, see my other monitor when I play. Especially when I play on console and I have a setup for that right now. I just typed in the switch because the switch was on my mind. Handgun. Okay, we can make one. Good, because... I was thinking I was going to have to jump cut again just to make a handgun because, you know, I'm a little bit low on iron, but we actually could have just bought iron. But boom, there's a Phoenix Blaster. Can we make the Necro enchantment? Fuck, what are we missing? The whole Necro armor set. I did not even put it in here. Oops, my bad. Dude, I can't wait. I, say, I feel like I say this like once every season. I can't wait until I'm able to put my modded armor on armor stands. <laughs> 1.3.6 can't come any sooner. Literally, please come out. Warding, please. I, I this is a must-have warding. There's no, there's no. Eh, armored is fine now. This is a must-have for warding. 
It's already kind of a weak accessory for having in hard mode. Alright, boom. There we go. Uh, we'll keep the Rune of Wrath, I guess. Might as well. There's no reason not to keep it. But yeah, that's going to end off this episode. We didn't do anything too exciting. I know. Calm down. But uh, don't worry. Like I said, episode 20 is right around the corner.